Hi guys, my name is Muhammad Naveed and in this lecture I am going to teach you B spline tool. By the word we can understand that spline, it will give us spline. Now how? First we need to come in toolbox and then we have to click on B spline. Now as you can see here my cursor has changed and with my cursor you can see here the spline is coming so it's showing me that now I'm ready to use B spline tool in order to use this what I do I simply click and drag and as you can see here when I'm as I leave as I click you can see here is giving me the I uh, can say the spline and if I hold down shift it will give me a straight line but as I release and I click and again click as you can see here the, the spline is coming and when I complete here when I complete the whole uh, you can spline so you can see here automatically it will join the end from where I started with with where I started you can see here is has given us the oval shape or something like that now let's see the some properties of B spline the first is the size you can adjust the size you can say the adjust you can adjust the size at the beginning if you want something so here if you want the arrow this kind of arrow you want you can also take the arrow there are many arrows are available so if you want this arrow or if you want the uh, you can say if you want this arrow or any kind of arrow if you want so you can also take arrow here then we have at the uh, at the you can say middle if you want to give any uh, line size so you can also give line style here then we have the arrow at the back so if you want to give the arrow at the back you can also give here you can see here it has given us the arrow now let's see the uh, the uh, the x and y if you can change the x and y position so for example if i want to change x y position to one you can see here it, it it can change the x and y position then we have the size you can adjust the size you can give the percentage and then we have the log we're showing us that if we have the log so if we have the log and if we increase the size for example if we increase the height so the width will automatically will be increased we we'll talk about that if we unlock it so if we increase the width or height so the next size okay say the width will not be increased if we increase the width the height will not increase and if we increase the height so width will not increase if we unlock it then we have the we can uh, set the angle let's suppose if i want to give the angle 90 degree angle so I can, I can also give 90 degree angle then we have mirror mirror means that uh, if I want to give mirror for example if you stand in the front of mirror so you find that yourself little bit different so if because of the mirror mirror automatically uh, you can say flip the image for example if you want to flip your image vertically horizontally you can also do here so basically this is all about B spline tool I hope you enjoy and learn thank you for watching Allah Hafiz